Hello, I'm ISBA President John Thies. As you may recall from one of my earlier video segments, I spoke about the ISBA's recent efforts within the American Bar Association's House of Delegates urging the reaffirmation of the model rules against non-lawyer involvement in the practice of law. I'm pleased to report that the widespread reaction we have received to these efforts has been very positive. There were other items on the House of Delegates agenda in August that I want to share with you today. Chicago's own Laurel Bellows took the helm of the association and outlined her plans as president. She will use her position to combat human trafficking, further gender equity, and protect against national cyber terrorism. Laurel knows that she has a friend and ally in the ISBA and that she can count on us for support during her presidency. Morris Dees received the ABA's Medal of Honor for his personal courage and incomparable leadership as one of the great civil rights lawyers of our time. He is truly charismatic and a selfless lawyer. Among other highlights, the ABA announced the formation of an 18-member task force on the future of legal education. This task force will spend the next two years examining how well law schools are meeting the needs of the profession in a changing marketplace. As you know, a related subject is being addressed during my term as ISBA president through our special committee on the impact of law school debt on the delivery of legal service. We hope that the work of this special committee will contribute to the discussions of this ABA task force. Till next time, I'm John Thies, and thanks for watching.